Hi friends, in this video we shall solve the questions given in exercise R2 from class 10 mathematics. Question number 1. What will be the digits in the unit place of the square of the following numbers? Here we are given some numbers and we are asked if you make square of this number then what will be the digit in unit place? Let's solve question number 1 sub number 1. Here first number is 272. Here in this number the unit digit is 2. 2 if you make square then you will get 2 into 2 4. It means if you make a square of this number then the unit digit of that number will be 4. So we are asked only to write the number which is in unit digit. So we are making a square of unit digit. So unit digit is 2. So 2 if you make a square you get 4. So your answer will be 4. Now number 2 here number is 79. In 79 the unit digit is 9. 9 if you make a square then what do you get 9 into 9 we get 81 it means in 81 the unit digit is 1 so if you make a square of this number then in unit digit we will get 1 now question number 3 400 here in 400 the unit digit is 0 0 if you make a square then what do you get 0 into 0 you get 0 so if you make a square of this number then in that number unit digit will be 0 now question number 4 2637 here unit digit is 7 7 if you make a square then what do you get 7 into 7 will get 49 in 49 unit digit is 9 so if you make a square of this number then in that number unit digit will be 9 now question number 2 why do the following numbers are not perfect square in this question we have to say the reason why this number are not perfect square so 2 if you make square then what do you get 2 into 2 4 so here 4 is a perfect square similarly 3 if you make square we get 9 so 9 is also a perfect square so in perfect square number the unit digit are always 0 1 4 5 6 or 9 so in perfect square number the unit digit are always 0 1 4 5 6 or 9 if you have other than this number in unit digit then you can say that number is not perfect square other than this number means if you have 2 in unit digit or in 3 or 7 or 8 then you can say that numbers are not perfect square so by looking at the unit digit we can say that number can be a perfect square or not if in unit digit we have 2 3 7 and 8 then we can say that number cannot be a perfect square to be a perfect square in unit digit we must have either 0 either 1 either 4 either 5 either 6 or 9 now question number 1 1057 in this number the unit digit is 7 so we know in unit digit we have 7 then that number cannot be a perfect square so the reason will be because in unit place we have 7 because 7 exists in the unit place next question number two seven nine two eight so here also we have in unit digit eight so we know if in unit digit there is eight then that number cannot be a perfect square so here also reason will be same because it exists in the unit digit Now number 3, here the number is 2, 2, 2. Here also in unit digit we have 2. So if in unit digit we have 2, that number cannot be a perfect square. So here reason will be because 2 exists in the unit digit. Now question number 4, 6, 4, 0. Here in unit place we have 0. See 
to be a perfect square the number of zeros must be even here we have only one zero one is a odd number so if number of zeros is odd then that number cannot be perfect square to be a perfect square the number of zeros must be even it must be two four six eight like that so since here number of zeros is even so this number cannot be a perfect square because here reason will be number of zeros is odd so this number cannot be a perfect square now question number three what are the squares of the following numbers so here we are asked to find square of this following number question number one we have 19 19 if you make square then you have to multiply 19 into 19 19 into 19 if you multiply you will get 361 now question number 2 37 now we have to find the square of 37 37 if you make square then we will multiply 37 into 37 so we will get 1369 next number is question number 3 we have 53 53 we need to make square 53 if you make square then we will multiply 53 into 53 then we will get 2809 now question number 4 we have 78 now you have to make square of 78 78 if you make square then we will multiply 78 into 78 then we will get 6084 now question number four find the square roots of the following by prime factorization method here in this question we are asked to find out the square root of the following numbers by using prime factorization method so first we will find out factor of this number here first number is 1764 so let's find out the factor of 1764 so factor here we get 1764 we'll get 2 into 2 then 3 into 3 then 7 into 7 now we'll make pair so here 2 we have 2 3 we have 2 and 7 we have 2 now the square root of 1764 will be from each pair we'll take out one number from this pair we'll take out 1 2 and from this pair we will take out 1 3 and from this pair we will take out 1 7 so if you multiply this three number then we will get 42 so square root of 1 7 6 4 is 42 i think remaining question you can try by yourself